I did this before and it futzed out on me, so I'm going to try it again. Um, so I went on training ride on Saturday. Like I said, I'm trying to do these videos now earlier in the week so that I remember the training ride and I'm perhaps even still a little tired from it. Um, I went on training ride on Saturday. It was a little over 33 miles. I averaged 11 and a half miles an hour, but that also included a climb up Rocky Butte and a climb up Mount Tabor. Both ways I haven't actually done before. Rocky Butte was really steep. It gets up to 11% in one spot, which is pretty dang steep for me. Um, I enjoyed it, though. I actually did it by myself. It's the first time I've gone out and done a training ride by myself, and I wasn't thrilled with that. I stopped partway through at my friend's house, which was two blocks out of my route. So I got to say hi to him and wag my finger at him for not coming along, and kind of, that was it. My legs are tired. Um, I wasn't completely dead the next day, but I was pretty cooked on Saturday and was insanely hyper on Sunday. Really, really hyper Sunday morning, particularly after I want, went and got acupuncture partway through Sunday. Um, yeah, that's pretty much about it. Nothing really exciting. Just another ride. Registration open today. I'll be registering probably sometime this week. It's $95 for the Seattle to Portland ride. And right now it's looking practically insurmountable, but I'm sure that will change by July when I've been doing, you know, training for six months now, as opposed to right now where I've been training for three weeks. So it's 4.30. I'm going to turn around and go to Aquafit and yoga tonight, which should be fun. I actually remembered to pack extra food for me, so I have a sandwich in my bag, which I'm looking forward to eating. And yeah, that's about it. Have a good week, guys. I'll try to keep posting these early in the week and if I have comments to make.